Yo guys, this is AG4N97 coming back at you with LA Noir once again. Coming here as a homicide dude, trying to get this case done again. Let's do this already. Let's get into it. There's no even need to explain myself anymore of what the possibilities are. The silk stocking murder, that is what we are doing. This is who we are going to be right now for the next hour, hopefully. Hopefully it takes an hour. And yup, there we go. This is what it is. And now we just got to do with it. What is there to do? I don't know. I don't remember this case that much. Let's find out. Ah, oh, Phelps. I was just discussing with Finbar here how well you were doing. Have a seat. Yeah, my real name. And you can just forget all about it. You boys have a new case. A poor Hispanic woman murdered near City Hall and left lying naked in an alleyway. Another naked woman, sir? Yes. God you damn seem it. I have had quite a run of them since the Dahlia Fiends first struck. Phelps is politely trying to hint that he thinks the Mendez case is hope. Well, young Phelps, you win some and you lose some in police work. You're happy with the Mueller case, sir? Over the moon, boys! The DA couldn't be more pleased with the evidence, the witness, and the lack of an alibi. Now, get out there and catch me another sinner. It's of the week. You have the address? It's the alley off Aliso of between Los Angeles and Alameda. You're kidding. The next one will be opposite Central Station. Count yourself lucky, Phelps. Most guys would kill to land a case so close to their desk. Yeah. It means they can pop in to hit the office supply of hooch whenever they need it. You know, that ain't a bad idea. That is not a bad idea at all, Phelps. Wow. Okay. So, what I have learned so far is a Mexican lady, and she's naked. And if you already have noticed, with the two naked ready women in his homicide case, it's pretty bad. It's pretty, the, the editing is really bad. I'm using a YouTube thing. It's not like... That YouTube thing is not very good. And that's the only thing I have right now. I can't get the what else. Oh my god, don't hit me. Oh, the central station is right here. That's why he said it. But, yeah, so... There you go. Hopefully, oh, I remember this one now. It's in the alley, right? Hopefully, the editing is not that bad. Hopefully, the editing is not that bad. We are at the crime scene at a one o'clock p.m. We're gonna solve it in the same day. Detectives. They're ready to start the show. I'll take you through. No. You see her legs. It's no reason to see the whole body yet. Yes, Phelps, hide it. Yeah, there you go. Oh, for Christ's sake. Brothers, Pinker. Cause of death is pretty apparent. We thought we'd best wait for you when you're ready. All right, let's... What the hell is that? Is that a sock? That's a big ass sock. If she took a blow to the head like the others, she was probably unconscious when strangled. It's not a sock. What's wrong with me? Oh, these are cigarettes. These are tissues. Well, I don't know what the hell tissues are doing here. I don't even know what the hell this is. It's useless, I think. Okay, let's check the other one. I know what this is. Let's put that back down. Uh, yeah, I'm just uh taking my time. 
I might as well just go do it already. Oh, can we just open this without looking? Nope, you gotta look at her. Look at her face. There you go. Let's try to get this done real quick. Oh my Another god. Another wedding ring torn from the finger. No skin under the fingernails. Alright, let's try to. Boom. The lacerations on the oh. neck would indicate a great deal of force. Let's check the other hand. Other hand, real quick. Does she has something? Nope. Only 21 years old. But why the library card? Did he want us to find it? Her name's Antonio. Kiss the blood, BD. The evidence in the Muller case was solid. I'm not convinced about Mendez. The best way to get away with murder is to pin it on somebody else. I'll bet a month's salary this is a copycat. Strangled, battered, naked. Yeah, 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 we know the M.O. So does every jerk who kills his wife and girlfriend looking for a way out. I've spoken to Brown. He still believes the Dahlia perp has medical experience. Four women, all murdered, all put on display, all with messages. Muller had no message. Look, Phelps, this is getting us nowhere. Anything for us to go on, Mal? Head injuries from contact with road, bruising from a small man's shoe, further blunt force trauma to the occipital region at the base of the skull. Could have been fatal, but clear signs of strangulation would seem to rule it out. Lipstick appears to be a similar color to the other cases. I'll see if I can nail down a brand. Let's not look at her. May as well follow the trail. Let's follow the trail. The yellow big road. Not the yellow big road, my bad. I think it's a yellow big road, actually. Antonia. Huh. Same as the library card. Amazing, Phelps. You have that amazing keen to know what is happening over here. This blood is so hard to see. You can barely see it. Oh, I heard something. There you go. I heard that and I was like, what is that? On it goes. Where it was stopped, nobody knows. Yep, there you go. Fine. Blood can't be the only person here. We kept the area pristine for you boys. Let's check it out. Can't be the only one here that just noticed the blood. Apartment five. Strung up like bait on a hook. Apartment five. Look at this. I don't even know how the blood got up there. That's got to be a code or a cipher. Let's put that back down, Phelps. We don't need this. These cases take like forever, I swear. I wonder what. You think he's trying to lead us somewhere? Probably all the way to City Hall, that brazen son of a bitch. Like. Where are you taking us? Like, I wonder why, like, he just put his hand up there. Maybe it was to show that he was going up here, but, like, it's still weird. Let's go upstairs. Phelps ain't got time for these small little games. Miss A. Malundo, I can't even say that name. Empty. Where is all of this meant to be taking us? Clearly wants us to find these things. He's left them for us. 
There you go, Phelps. You got a new MO. I told you. Yeah. Or he might Boy. just be getting more confident. There you go, Phelps. Obviously, I don't think that just because he's leaving stuff here is the new MO. No, it just means. I almost, almost missed that. Enameled and gold plated. This was precious to her. How the hell do you know that, dude? Like, obviously, that means is that. Is that, um. Wait, let me, let me think of my reasoning here before I try to go crazy. Trail points up. Amazing. Okay, obviously, that means that he wants to get caught already because he's leaving shit. He knows the cops ain't doing what they're supposed to do, or Phelps, in that regard. And. Pulled from the finger and hung up here. What's the significance? Amazing. Okay. Phelps, he like the dude knows that the cops ain't doing what they're supposed to be doing. The hell is this? Oh, it's a print bush. Looks as though the killer was decorating with this. Uh, fingerprints. Even though I don't think that's there yet. There's half the library card. Son of a bitch, once her identified. Mrs. Antonia Maldonado, 712 North Hill Street, downtown. I'm glad you remember that. Boom! Let me check my clues and see if I have everything. I think I do. Mm-hmm. Yup. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Key. Dot pattern. Library card. Bloody print brush. I don't even have. What? I didn't I get the bloody print brush? I don't hear the song anymore. No, oh, they moved the body. That was quick. Maybe let me let me listen because I don't. Yeah, we're good. This is the crime area, and I do not hear the song. That was this. That was most kill. This is later on in the game. Let's go back in the car. We have everything we need. Why does the car get all better? Straighten up and fly, right? It was Mrs. Maldonado, right? That's affirmative. All right, so then there's a husband we should be looking for. Get him. We've closed the case. Ah, uh, Rusty's razor, of course. I don't want to question your tried and tested techniques, Detective Galloway. But doesn't the DA require sound casework before he'll close the book? Not if he's got a confession. And, you know, there's ways of getting it. I'm sure. I'm sure, yes. It's called beating them out of your victim, Phelps. You're new to this police thing. Very new. But it's okay. Sooner or later, you will find out everything. Anyway. I forgot what the hell I was talking about. It doesn't even matter. We're back. Well, don't hit me. We're on to the other dudes. I feel like everything got better. Was it like a year that passed or what? Oh, maybe that's why. Let me see something again. I'm... Yeah, okay. I'm sorry, I'm getting confused on something, that's why. I'm just trying to remember, like, what I had before. This is a weird-ass house. Is this, like, an apartment? Wait just a moment! It's an old-ass lady. Of course it is. I'm 
sorry. Can I help you? LAPD, ma'am. Detective Phelps and Galloway. Does Mrs. Maldonado live here? Yes, she does. I'm Mrs. Barbara Lepente, the owner of this boarding house. Is there a problem? I'm afraid so, ma'am. Do you mind if we come in? Is there somewhere we can discuss this? Of course. Follow me through to the parlor. Wipe your feet as you come in, detectives. It's this way. Mrs. Maldonado was found dead this morning. Dead? Oh, no. She can't be. I'm afraid she was murdered, ma'am. We need to take a look at her things. I can't believe it. A person seems so alive, and then they're gone. Amazing. Antonia's room is upstairs, last door on the left. Thank you. We'll be back shortly. Uh, excuse us a moment, ma'am. Yeah, just wait down here. We got we probably got questions for you. What the hell, dude? Don't confuse me like that. You can't be telling showing me these places in which way I don't know where to go. Alright, that's door on the left. It's right here. Let's knock on it. Nope, it's open. Oh my gosh, you can't tell big ass right here. Did you look at that? Someone's turned the place over. What's in here? Miss Antonio, her Isabel Montorado, I think. CO Persons Boarding House, 712. I'm not going to read all that. Antonio, fair to my previous correspondence of August 7th, I am writing to inform you that your petition to the Superior Court of the State of California has been accepted and a court date scheduled your case. Docket number 98765 will be heard on September 17th. I am told that your husband... Okay, we have an address. Amazing. I am told that your husband, Angel Christopher Montedado, residing at 304 to 330, so an apartment, in Hill State, Los Angeles, California, has been served with the official papers in and is on notice to appear at the Central District Court on the above date. Though it is not essential and many women in your position choose not to do so, I would advise you also to appear at the Central District Court on the scheduled date. In my experience, a woman plaintiff presence in case like this one can do much to influence proceedings and if your husband does not appear on September 17th which you have told me is likely then it can only help our chances you're, sis you're sincerely that dude's name that dude's name yep there you go dude's name all over the place obviously they got served with papers someone got into a fight 